Well, next year, Portland Public School says that they're going to see a big dip in enrollment, which they say is on par with the rest of the country. Yeah, they're expecting 8%. 8% of their students to leave, and they say there will be an impact on staffing. Fox 12's Drew Marine spoke with a PPS parent who's concerned about this and how it will change her children's learning. Drew? Yeah, that's right. Donna Ingram has three kids who go to Reiki Elementary School here in South Portland. She says staffing has been minimal since they moved to Portland last year, and now she's taken a volunteer position to help at lunchtime. A new school year is just around the corner, and Portland Public Schools expects to see 3,400 students leaving the district with the highest drop in enrollment at elementary schools. They say because of that decline, there's a potential for less state funding, and they expect they'll need to make staff cuts. It's disappointing. State funding is not down. Portland Public Schools is going to have more funding next year than we have ever had. While PPS says they're maintaining 40 positions and more than 30 social workers with one-time federal funding, they say right now they expect to make 105 cuts for the 2022-2023 school year, which includes 65 K-5 through homeroom teachers and 45 middle school teachers. That number could change. Portland Association of Teachers President Elizabeth Teal says with those cuts, classroom sizes will be high and impact students' education. What that means is a school that maybe had three sections of kindergarten, they're going to have two sections of kindergarten. If we have lower enrollment in our schools and the opportunity to have kindergartens, say of 22 students instead of 29, our students need that opportunity. Portland parent Donna Ingram already volunteers at Reiki Elementary School. I volunteer at lunch and um, there's more volunteers and staff. And is worried about what these cuts will mean for her kids next year. Students want interaction. They want someone to come up and say like, hey, how are you doing? Like even just the most silly interaction, like look at how beautiful that drawing is. They want people who are there consistently and having the staff to be there and support the teachers and help the teachers to be their best selves is the most important thing. And so it's really sad to think that our kids will get even less involvement from caring adults. Um, it takes a village to raise kids. The Portland Public Schools superintendent is expected to present the complete budget for the next school year on April 26th. Live in South Portland, Drew Marine, Fox 12, Oregon.